Cobra Kai. I'm kidding. Bonsai! I'm the Cobra Kai Kid, and Griffin Santopietro, who plays Anthony LaRusso on Cobra Kai, just recently did an interview with After Buzz TV where he talked about his character and what to expect in Cobra Kai Season 5. The full article is great. Griffin talks about what it was like working on the set of Season 4 and getting a bigger role this season. Right now, we're only going to focus on his comment about Season 5, but if you want to check out the full article, I'll leave a link in the description. Can you give us any any uh, little tidbits of what to expect for your character for next season? Um, I would say that the one thing I like is the, not the one thing I like, but one of my favorite things about the next season is that you see that Anthony's continue to growing to be growing as a person. You know, um, I think you see that he he feels bad for what he did to Kenny, and um, uh, and so it's not so it's not like he so he's you know I feel like season four you kind of saw. You know, I think that that end of that season was kind of him getting his comeuppance um, for his for his bullying. So as Griffin states here, he will be feeling sorry about what he did to Kenny in season four, because as we saw in season four, the whole season, him and his friends were just constantly picking on Kenny. But then towards the end of this season, we saw him start to become apologetic. He tried to apologize to Kenny multiple times. Kenny just wouldn't accept it. Even in episode two of season four, when uh, they first started bullying Kenny, you know, Anthony didn't want to fight him. Sure, he was calling him names, but he and Ashley want to get into a physical altercation with him but that doesn't excuse any of anthony's actions he still continued to pick on kenny steal his clothes and do all this terrible stuff to him but we know that there is that kindness in him he just wasn't really showing it but we do know that anthony lorusso is not a terrible human being and after he realized what he really did to kenny and we started to see a different anthony towards the end of season four starting to regret the decisions he's made and try to make up for it but ultimately it was too late as kenny you know gave him that beat down and said get ready for high school next year you're gonna be in a world of pain so kenny was not accepting his apology and it will be interesting to see because kenny and anthony will be entering high school next year they'll be with all the other kids such as miguel sam you know they'll all be seniors while anthony and kenny and leah they'll be freshmen and with kenny going down this dark road it only seems like he's going to get more and more evil maybe he'll form his own little group at school of cobra kai's and then start to pick on anthony so now the roles are reversing so you have anthony is now the one getting bullied similar to how daniel was getting bullied in karate kid you have kenny and his friends picking on anthony so the bully has now become the bullied and the bullied has now become the bully so role reversal right there now based on griffin's comments it doesn't seem like anthony is going to go after kenny and get revenge on him because he's literally saying he feels sorry for what he did to kenny so in a way he probably feels like Kenny had every right to do what he did, even though obviously like who wants to get beaten up? You know, maybe Anthony felt like he deserved it because in a way he did. So maybe he'll have that approach in season five instead of this. Kenny beat me up. I'm going to get revenge because ultimately the reason why Kenny beat you up is because you were beating him up. You were bullying him. And I think Anthony will be aware of that. And they'll be interesting to see um, what guides, what mentors he has in season five. I think Samantha is going to be a mentor to him, play that big sister role. That was the one thing we were missing in season four, but I think they're saving that for season five, especially with Anthony having a bigger arc. We've never really seen a brother-sister dynamic in Cobra Kai, so I think getting that in season five with Sam and Anthony would be really cool. And then we have Daniel, who's his father, obviously, if uh, Anthony's being bullied. Daniel will be able to relate to that and help him out. Maybe Anthony will turn to Miyagi Do Karate and learn under Chosen. There's a lot of mentors, a lot of people around Anthony that could possibly help him out. And based on Griffin's comments, it seems like Anthony is starting to head down the right path and maybe the path of Miyagi Do. He'll start to find his balance. We'll just have to wait and see. But what did you guys think of Griffin Santo Pietro's comments about Anthony's arc in season five of Cobra Kai? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure to subscribe to Cobra Kai Kid and turn on all notifications to never miss a new video. Hit that like button and share the video with your fellow Cobras and Miyagi-Dos. I'll see you all next time on Cobra Kai Kid. And until then, remember, Cobra Kai, 
never dies.